So I'm here with Lance Kinsey and James Portalesi. Did I say that right? Yep, you did. Yeah, with All Stars. So welcome, fellas. Thank, welcome you. Thank you very much. Uh, is this your first time here in Nashville? I, uh, it's my first time. I yeah. went to college here. I, I graduated from Vanderbilt. Oh, awesome. What did you study? I uh, Drama. Drama in English. As most people that go to Vanderbilt tend to do. So, <laughs> cool. um, so Jay, uh, Lance, I've noticed that you have a lot of credits doing many things. This is your first time directing. Um, yeah. Is there a... Um, like, what made you decide that you wanted to direct this project or that you didn't want someone else to direct it? Because I guess it's your story, right? It is, that's right. I mean, I, I lived it. It was, uh, it was really my story. And as I wrote it, you know, there's some real advantages to directing something you write because as you write it, you're thinking about how you want to shoot it. Uh, and I knew that we'd have a tight budget and a very tight schedule. And uh, that really, that, that helped a lot. Yeah. Uh, and then, James, how did you get involved in the project? Well, Lance, I'd known Lance for maybe 10 years, but we never did a project together. And he called and said, you know, I, I think I got, this, I got the money, and I think we can make this movie this summer. And he asked me to help him, so I did. And, you know, being that it was his first time, but it was his world, I was totally confident that he could do it because he knew the world so well, and he did an amazing job. So it was great. Awesome. Was it difficult taking your story and putting it? Because a lot of times when you take true stories, you've got to adapt it a little bit. Like, was it hard to add that creativeness to it and not stay strict to the history? No, not really. I mean, it, for me, it was it was relatively easy to write uh, because I knew the world so well. And, you know, as I had coached my daughter from when she was like five all the way through her rec league career and then watched her play uh, travel ball and club ball, I knew every one of these characters. I mean, I, people always say, well, you know, comedy is so great because you take reality and then you exaggerate it. There's very little exaggeration in this movie. I mean, this is, they, they, they act insanely sometimes, but always with a good heart and good spirit. It's just, you, they, uh, you know, they get caught up. And it's, it's really very, very funny. Yeah. Awesome. So you're doing the festival circuit now. Um, what's next for the film? Uh, we're going to Newport Beach Film Festival next weekend. And then uh, we're going to Soho in New York in May. And then we're going to Heartland again in Indianapolis. They're going to show the film again for their film festival. And then um, hopefully it's going to be released like late summer, early fall in theaters. So, yep. Great. So anyone that's not able to make it to one of the hundreds of festivals around yep. will be able to see it in theater soon. Uh, so yeah, that's right, that's very right. good. Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you both thank for coming. You. I hope thank that, or actually I have one last question. So what your, if you could have a big takeaway from the film, like that you want people to know about you and about life, um, what would that be? Hmm. I know, I'm ending on about a deep life. Note. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, it's really, I think, that just don't take things so seriously. Yeah. You know, uh, enjoy the moment, but if you can, if you can just step back and kind of uh, view things for what they are, so take a breath, you know, I mean, basically have a good time. Yeah. And if you don't, if you don't recognize the parents in the film, you might be the crazy parent in the movie you know and you just might not know it so they might want to recognize themselves as, as having that crazy parent problem so which I guess is good and bad because then if people recognize that they're the crazy parent then you might have fewer of them and yeah. yeah which will be nice yeah. but then it won't be a little more boring <laughs> so I don't know believe me you're not gonna have fewer of them <laughs> very true well guys thank you so much for coming Appreciate yeah absolutely good night. bye